Hi, my name is Dr. Brian Curtis, and I'm one of the paleontologists here at Fossil Crates. This cool creature over my shoulder is known as Zephactinus audax, the sword ray fish. And this creature was a bony fish over 20 feet long. There have been individuals discovered that were 13 feet long that swallowed six foot long fish completely. The ability to open its mouth very wide and inhale was tremendous, but it also had those wonderfully toothy maws, which is why it's also affectionately known as the bulldog fish. Now this particular animal in most environs would have been the top apex predator, but where it lived in what you may affectionately know as the savage ancient seas of the Western Interior Seaway in the late Cretaceous of Kansas, the middle part of the United States at the end of the Cretaceous was covered by an ocean from the Colorado Rockies to the Appalachian Mountains was one big ocean that ran from the Gulf of Mexico all the way north up to Alaska. And in this body of water lived some of the most fearsome aquatic predators ever, Zephactinus being one of them. However, Zephactinus remains have been found in the bellies of Cretoxyrhina, a shark that exceeds the size of the great white shark today, as well as in Tylosaurus, a kind of mosasaur that was 50 feet long. However, Zephactinus has been found with mosasaur flippers in its mouth. So as a result, these animals were not only eating all the other creatures, but they were eating each other too. An extraordinarily dangerous place to be. Hope you enjoyed hearing a little bit about Zephactinus, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Like us, subscribe us, and please add comments below. Thank you kindly. Adios.